Vamos a pisar ahora. ¡Eso, eso, vamos! What's good, friends and family? Mr. Flip Flop. Beautiful Monday morning here in uh, Sisua. A little bit of rain. So, seeing we have some good news, but before I get to that, we've been having a lot of drama the past couple of days, so allow me to put this to rest because I don't like negativity, I don't like drama. But the reality is, we have people, uh, maybe sick people, who still support the boy. Uh, his fans have made a couple of videos about me. And I, I did my response yesterday to something that was said, but um, he has a lot of fans and supporters, and I was told his fans made a couple videos. So let me get back to the gatekeeper comment, which I responded in Sunday service. I know a lot of information down here. And, yeah, a lot of information. But, as I tell everybody, in Sasua, you cannot go off of a rumor because rumors run the town. So unless there's proof or evidence... You can't do anything because it could be someone doesn't like you and they're just making a rumor up about you. I have rumors about me. As I said yesterday, to give you an example, and this has happened. If a chick doesn't like another girl, she will tell all the guys that girl has HIV. It's not true, but just a rumor because she doesn't like that particular person. So when I heard the rumors about old boy, yes, I was concerned, but without proof, you can't do anything. Now, I commented because the proof obviously came out later on, and all of you are in hindsight saying blah, blah, blah. None of you knew. Nobody. There was rumors here and there, but nobody actually knew. Then we found out it was real. So, while his fans make these little videos trying to trash me, you know, because he has a lot of fans, um, and they've been fans of other YouTubers too, but now they're fans of his, just know that when I said I'm the gatekeeper, I have the info. And I also have some info on a couple of his fans too. So they might want to watch that, but we're going to leave that alone because I'm not into the drama no more. I'll let his fans continue to be his fans. Maybe they're my fans too. Who knows? So, as you guys see a little bit of celebration, the mayor's race uh, on Sunday, it seems as though at the early calculations that Willie El Chamo won by far, by a big margin at that. Um, now, the official numbers have, I think they come out today. But they were going over the numbers last night, and it seemed that he won. There was a celebration last night. So we'll see if he makes the sewer great again or whatever the case may be. But maybe things will go back to normal as far as they were 10 years ago when it was flooded and everybody was just having a good time and all the businesses were prospering. So uh, El Chamo, as of now, the, official, the unofficial word is that he won by a landslide. Uh, we'll see what the official numbers are. But everyone was out partying last night and celebrating in the streets, playing music, honking their horns, that El Chamo, Willie, won the mayor's race of Sisua. So we'll see what that leads to. And I will say this. Uh, the last election, it was almost similar, where they said El Chamo won, but come to find out the mayor who's in now won, and people were calling foul, saying there was something going on with the votes. So I did see throughout the country there were a lot of upsets. It's like when people had that situation back in February with the election fraud or whatever was going on with the machines, this made a lot of people come out and actually vote for real this time. Where they were like, you know what, we probably weren't going to vote in February, but now after all the drama, they came in and wanted change. So as of now, unofficially, should be official today, Willie El Chamo should be the new mayor of Sisu. So you guys stay tuned. I got more coming this week. Shout to all y'all who uh, got into the Sunday service. Shout to all y'all who support me. Um, shout to the fans who secretly hate. You know, they, they cool too. They aight. Uh, but um, shout to everybody. And uh, I'm going to keep the info coming. Much love from me to you. You guys be safe with that coronavirus. I know 
certain states might be going to lockdown tomorrow. Unfortunately, we'll see what happens. Haiti just went into lockdown from DR. And just so you guys know, there have been 11 confirmed cases in the whole Dominican Republic. Um, I don't know if anybody's telling you different numbers, but it's been 11 cases in the entire Dominican Republic confirmed, and they have all been from tourists. It has not been any Dominicans that I know of that, that they've reported have been sick. So you guys be safe out there. Keep the hand sanitizer. Try not to give too much uh, contact and enjoy yourself. Be safe. Mr. Flip Flop, I'm out.